a long way since Groom It's World, which was your first foray into TV. What are some of the lessons you've learned along the way, you know, in the demanding world of entertainment and being funny? My first foray was actually Live on Fire. That was the... Live was the on first, Fire? Live on Fire. It was a variety show, live show, one hour, and I was the only host. It was my first time on TV. Carl, how old thrown. were you? Hmm. I was just 29, 30. Oh, okay. Yeah. Wow. So, I'm 50 this year. Right. I'm 51 this month actually. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, <laughs> yeah, I just realized. Um, um, one of the lessons, the many lessons I've learned, of course, uh, but one I will always keep it to heart is that uh, you have to stay humble and that uh, no matter how big your celebrity status is, you are just one small part of the entire package. Because I always say, without the wardrobe lady, without the technical guy, without the lighting guy, without the director, without the cameraman, without writers without everybody plays a role it's just what happens that I am in front of the camera that's all uh, without them I'll be nothing also so I always tell anybody who wants some advice about the entertainment industry is to always remember small that you are small a small part and you have your role to play and don't let ego overtake uh, I remember an incident where at the end I'll get a signal uh, to me it would be like okay can end the show now say goodnight and all that right mm -hmm. those days we didn't have a earpiece we only had hand signals from the floor right. manager so I was saying, okay, Singapore, good night, thank you very much. We'll be in on next week again. I hope you join me. And then Sunny, when I'm saying this in mid-sentence, <clears throat> the floor manager gives me a signal. No, I'll continue, continue. <laughs> they give me a signal, two more minutes to go. Oh, yo. So I start talking about the band behind me, weren't they wonderful, and then the audience, and this and that, and then all that, that. But that made me realize that we are so interdependent. I could have just said, no, it's your fault, and I walk away kind of thing. But... We all have to help each other out. And then uh, floor managers will always help me, give me some pointers, give me some feedback. So things like that, I, I thought very early on that uh, it's important to play your role and know your, 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 your place in the system, in the package, that you're not the whole thing. You know? You're just a small. Thing.